Punto Hobbs rebaja en un 50% todas sus tarifas. Visita Punto Hobbs haciendo clic en cualquiera de los banners de concafe.com. Punto Hobbs, alojamiento web, correo electrónico, servicio en la nube. Punto Hobbs, te da más. Estamos usando la red 3G de Movistar para descargar, subir videos, navegar y publicar en Concafé. Movistar, compartida, la vida es más. Hazle mantenimiento a tu computadora. Repara el software de tu dispositivo móvil. Pasa los datos de tu teléfono a otro. En la carrera 13, entre calles 10 y 9, Calabozo. En Computodo lo tienen todo. Ya le sacaron los frijoles. Granos, salsas, delicateces y deliciosos jugos naturales los consigues en la Carrera 12 entre calles 10 y 11 en Calabozo. El arabito para saciar tu apetito. Good evening, and thank you for joining us for an exciting night ahead. I'd like to send a special hello to all the BlackBerry fans worldwide watching this via live stream. I am Kevin Michaluk, better known in the tech world as Crackberry Kevin, and tonight I have the great pleasure to be your host as TCL Communication unveils a distinctly different smartphone experience as we head into the start of Mobile World Congress 2017. I'm sure you've been following the news from late last year and more recently at CES last month. TCL Communication, as part of a new licensing partnership with Black. completely reimagine this for your rediscovery. This smart keyboard, it goes beyond pure typing with gesture at touch that allows the keyboard to act as a trackpad so you can easily scroll through all of your messages, your calendar appointments, your web pages, flick to type, slide along the keys to move the cursor. But it does so much more. In addition to the beloved convenience key on the side, each letter is also programmable as well, 
allowing you to launch 52 customizable shortcuts with both a short press and a long press action. Just think of all the opportunities here. And as well as that, it's 100% Android, launch, uh, launching on the latest uh, Nougat 7.1, so you have access to all of the Google Play applications. Launching your favorite applications has never been easier. Let me give you a few examples here. Say I just want to catch up with the news and the latest information, so I can just browse the web. I simply assign the letter B key on my keyboard, and I can open the browser and access the information that's important to me. If you just think about it now with shortcuts, it's so easy. U becomes Uber, I becomes Instagram, F becomes Facebook. All of your favorite applications are now simply a key press away, saving you precious seconds hundreds of times a day. Now, we all know a thing or two about email these days as well, but we wanted to make sure writing that email on the go was even easier. So starting with your most frequent contacts. So imagine I'm always emailing my boss. Why don't I just set that up as a simple shortcut so I can instantly start that next email really easily? Now, perhaps one of my favorite shortcuts, and we all do it all, probably every single day, is just checking up on the weather. So all I need to do is I can simply assign the W key, and it will instantly show me the weather back home. And I can see that it's definitely not going to be Barcelona weather in London. Now, being on the latest version of Nougat, wouldn't it be great if you could benefit from some of the amazing experiences on the platform, like multi-window view? Well, now you can, thanks to the combination of the 4.5-inch Full HD display and the physical keyboard design, you actually have more usable screen space when typing versus a much larger all-touch dis display due to the on-screen keyboard. Look, the BlackBerry Key 1 was intentionally built for power communicators. If you are someone that uses your phone a lot for emailing, text messaging, or social media updates, then this is the perfect device for you. And in today's world, being a modern communication device, this is staying connected on the go, not having to worry about where you're going to have to find your next charge, which is exactly why we included the biggest battery ever in a BlackBerry. At 3505 milliamps, that's bigger than most flagships today, and probably bigger than most smartphones you have in your pockets tonight. But we didn't stop there we also included a unique feature called Boost. Boost allows you to turbocharge your battery, giving you the most charge in the limited amount of time. So imagine you've just come home from work and you need to have a really quick turnaround before you head out for the evening. Boost lets you get the maximum charge in that minimum time by actually putting the device into battery saving mode while it's charging. Now, of course, look, it wouldn't be distinctly BlackBerry if we didn't have the BlackBerry Hub to bring all of your messages into one place. This unified inbox is an irreplaceable tool, tool to consolidate all of your messages, whether it be your email, your phone calls, your text messages, or your favorite social communication like Facebook, WhatsApp, LinkedIn. All of these brought together in one single location, so you no longer need to jump to between multiple inboxes to manage your information. Look, there are so many smart features and awesome new experiences on the BlackBerry Key 1. We're really excited to have you see for yourself why we think this is the BlackBerry smartphone that fans have been waiting for, and the device that everyone will be excited about BlackBerry smartphones again. I hope you've seen tonight that this is the perfect device with no compromises. Thank you very much, and I'll see a lot of you later. Thanks so much, Logan, for the detailed BlackBerry Key 1 overview. I can't wait to get mine home and dig into all the features. Of course, we know today that a lot of what makes a smartphone reliable and efficient has a lot to do with the chipset powering the device. To tell us a bit more about the Snapdragon processor powering the BlackBerry Key 1, please welcome Pete Lancia, Vice President, Qualcomm. Thank you. Um, I can truly say it's both an honor and a pleasure to be here to help with the celebrate the launch of 
BlackBerry's key one. Um, it's very exciting to be part of the new evolution of BlackBerry smartphones. Um, and with Key One using and leveraging Qualcomm's Snapdragon 625 processor. As a partner from the beginning, we we're very focused on helping BlackBerry meet some very specific requirements and visions for this device. Namely, great multitasking experience, but at the same time optimized for battery performance. With our Snapdragon 625, we can pr provide Key One users with the processing, power, and visuals that they demand throughout the day without unnecessarily tapping into the battery power. This, combined with the largest battery ever included in a BlackBerry smartphone, ensures that users can enjoy all their experiences throughout the day without looking for a charge. And because we know how important quick charging has become, we're very proud to say that the, the BlackBerry device includes uh, Quick Charge 3.0. The result of that is pretty phenomenal. Up to four times faster charging than a conventional charge, and up to 27% faster, and 45% more efficient when you compare it to Quick Charge 2.0. But the Snapdragon 625 doesn't end there. It includes our X9 LTE modem. And what this delivers for consumers with the uh, BlackBerry Key One device is two times faster download speeds compared to previous versions, and as well as best-in-class network, network coverage. So that's all I have to hear to say. I hope you enjoy the BlackBerry Key One. Thank you. Now joining us from BlackBerry, please welcome Alex Thurber to share more about the security features on BlackBerry Key One which make this the most secure Android smartphone experience today. Thank you, Kevin. And thank you to Nicholas and TCL Communication for having me here with you all tonight. BlackBerry is very, very excited about the launch of the BlackBerry Key One, the first smartphone to be launched with a global licensing partner. At BlackBerry, we live and breathe security. It's in the DNA of everything we do, especially in our smartphone software. Now, we have worked very closely with TCL to build security into every layer of the BlackBerry Key One. I have to say, I joined BlackBerry almost a year ago, and one of the first things I did was get a complete briefing on exactly what we do to Android to make it so secure. <clears throat> Excuse me. My background is in security, and I, it was amazing all the different areas and all the different layers that we touch in the Android operating system. We are truly very confident in our security prowess when it comes to Android. Security has been engineered into the entire manufacturing process, throughout the hardware, and of course the software. And together, most importantly, we are committed with TCL to bring out the monthly Android security updates because we all know that if you don't keep your product up to date, if you don't keep your software up to date from a security perspective, you lose that advantage very quickly. Now, the concept of security is changing. The perimeter is disappearing. It's no longer just about talk, uh, talking about attacks on your smartphone. It's anticipating the next sophisticated vulnerability before it happens. And BlackBerry Key One gives users control and visibility over the security of their smartphone using the DTEC application. And the DTEC application is really, a, it's really an amazing feature that we've been able to bring into Android. And it's been a feature since we brought out the Priv almost two years ago. What's very interesting about the DTEC app is not only that it's a dashboard, a visibility into the security status of your phone, but it actually allows you to go in and adjust particular parameters to ensure that you are ultimately making the choice of just how secure you want your phone to be. I have a 20-year-old daughter, and she is a true millennial. She overshares everything. Whether it's her pictures or her location or where she is that evening, she's always putting out information from her smartphone. And the DTEC app allows her to do that. It allows her to fine tune the security parameters for her particular use. Now, some of, some of you may have noticed I'm not a millennial. 
and I'm also a little bit more conservative when it comes to sharing information, and my company is incredibly more conservative when it comes to sharing information. So I can be confident through the DTEC app to know that my phone is as secure as I want it to be, and that there are no applications that might be utilizing elements of the phone, be it the camera or the microphone or access to the storage unit, in ways that I didn't authorize. So at the most important, I think, in both of those areas is that it gives the user choice. And that's something that we are very focused on at BlackBerry. The BlackBerry Key One, along with BlackBerry Enterprise software, ensures that one's company data as well is protected. And the Key One, along with that DTEC app, ensures that your individual privacy is protected as well. The Key One is a great mobility solution for enterprises looking to provide their employees with a very productive smartphone while ensuring the security, the choice of security is exactly where they want that to be. And at the same time, uh, providing individuals the ability to be as private as they want to be with their information and with their smartphone. At the end of the day, it's all about choice. So thank you all very much for allowing me to be here today to talk about BlackBerry security, and I look forward to more conversations afterwards. Thank you. Thank you, Alex, for taking us through a deeper dive on just what goes into making the BlackBerry Key One the most secure Android smartphone available today. And now, the moment I know you've all been waiting for. Please welcome back Nicholas Zabel to share when and where you'll be able to purchase the new BlackBerry Key One. Thank you, Kevin. As you can see, we are all very excited about this new BlackBerry Key One launch. But now, let's talk about the availability of this device. And we are very proud to share that this device will be available across the globe starting as early as April. You will be able to purchase the BlackBerry Key One in multiple locations, retailers, and carrier partners. Some of them are here present tonight, and I'd like to thank them. And now let's talk about the price. This flagship premium device will be priced at just 599 euro, 499 pounds, or 549 dollars in the U.S. You can learn more about the BlackBerry Key One, signing up for information, signing up for on-sale events, with a new website, which we are putting live today. And this is blackberrymobile.com. Please check up on this website. At the same time, do not hesitate to come and visit us at MWC and you can see the details of the booth here on the screen. You're all welcome to come and visit us. But before we close this event, I would like to thank especially someone who has been working for months tirelessly to make all of this possible, to bring the product to market, and to probably set up one of the best teams of the industry. I'd like to welcome on stage Alain Lejeune. Please come. He's our president of BlackBerry Mobile. Thank you, Alain. And Alain will be running BlackBerry Mobile with a fully dedicated and autonomous team and to make sure that this BlackBerry Mobile is a success. Distinctly BlackBerry. Thank you, Alain. Thank you, Nicholas. Folks, would you please join me in a round of applause for Nicholas and the entire TCL communication and BlackBerry mobile team Thank you. for making tonight possible. Thank you. And not to worry, the night isn't over yet. We're like, we're BlackBerry, we're fast and efficient. We welcome those of you here to join us as we celebrate this evening and the start of MW20, MWC 2017 backstage for the official BlackBerry Key One launch party. Thank you. Thank you. Welcome. Thank you. Thank you, Kevin. Thank you very much.
Twitter is hibernating. Be on these.